I'm Jamie, registered dietitian at Lake House Integrative Medicine Department inside the Bruner San and Dietrich Wellness Campus. And I have my friend Owen with me today. We put together some videos and we made some recipes that are kid friendly and healthy for you to make with your family. Hi, I'm Owen, I'm 12 years old. I had a lot of fun working in the kitchen and I hope you do too. Always remember before you start cooking, always wash your hands. All right, so we're making chia seed, peanut butter, banana breakfast cookies. And I've got two um, large uh, bananas mashed, or you could do three small ones mashed, whatever you have. A little bit of salt. I've got mini chocolate chips in here. Um, ground flax seed, chia seed, a little bit of cinnamon, and then we've got our oats. These are a great alternative for um, a cookie, especially if you're craving something sweet or an on-the-go um, breakfast in the morning. And um, they're filling because of the whole grain oats. You've got some fiber in here, you've got some healthy fats. And they're nice because you can use whatever you have in your pantry. It doesn't have to be these exact ingredients. If you have raisins or some sort of other dried fruit or nuts, you can mix and match and make them however you like. We're gonna add everything together All right, so everything's together in our bowl. We're gonna mix this up. You just wanna make sure everything's kind of um, moist and it's sticking together. You don't have to worry about the consistency too much. Just make sure everything is combined. So this is gonna make about 12 cookies. And um, when you space them out, you don't have to worry about them being too close together. They're not gonna move um, or get any bigger when they're baking. So if you have them close together, you can totally do that. And then once the cookies are on, we're gonna flatten them a little bit. I'm just gonna use a little cup here, just flatten them down so they're like little discs and then they'll be ready to go in the oven. So these are ready for the oven. Always make sure you have an adult put these in for you. These are gonna bake for 13 to 15 minutes at 350. And you'll know they're done when they're firm, but still a little bit soft to the touch. All right, so our cookies are done. We let them cool for five minutes, and then we're gonna drizzle them with some peanut butter. Once your peanut butter is drizzled, your cookies are ready to go. These will stay in the fridge for about a week. They're a great on-the-go breakfast or a quick snack. You've got fiber and healthy fats in here and um, no added sugar. So if you love cookies for a breakfast, gotta try them.